This is a quick example of IonCAD's smart assembly capabilities. We'll drag and drop out a pallet assembly and then import a part to be placed on top of that pallet. The goal here is to create a custom packaging solution to fit the imported part. We'll then push and pull to resize our pallet and snap it to the sides of our imported part. As you can see, the pallet is being resized as a whole and all of the parts contained within that assembly are automatically resizing and positioning themselves based upon the full assembly size that we want to use. The amount of planks lengthwise in the pallet is automatically increasing or decreasing based upon the length we choose to use and the brackets around the edges are automatically snapping to the sides because that's where they're useful. As you can see when we drag and drop out the side of the pallet here, it's automatically snapping in to the base brackets on the base pallet. We'll drag and drop out the other side here and snap that to the height of the first side. And then we'll drag and drop out an end, actually a different end in this case. And then we'll resize the end to snap to the top of the sides. As the end is being stretched upwards, you can see that the angle of some of the planks as well as their length is automatically changing and updating. After dropping the corners, we'll then drop the lid, which also automatically positions into place. Now you may have noticed that we do need to stretch one side a little bit further. Now to do this, we can simply stretch the base pallet and the rest of the model will automatically update for us. Thanks for watching and thanks to Nefab for their catalogue and demonstration models.